Yes, I, I, for anybody who doesn't know me, a lot of people do here. Um, I'm Adam from the Now Project. What we do is we work with students within uh, Glenfay who are thinking about leaving, what they're going to do when they leave. And today we've got Lockshore in and I for Education, which is Darren. And Darren would come in and mentor and encourage these, these young people in uh, running their business. But Darren's going to explain that in a wee second. Everybody here, uh, he's maybe a wee bit younger, you're going to be leaving school eventually. And you may work with me thinking about what you're going to do, if it's course, work, or whatever. No? Yes, you work with me. So what we're going to do is we're going to really encourage, this is uh, young guys from Lockshore, and they're really going to try and encourage you. And when you move out here, there's a lot of different businesses going here, Darren, so they're wanting to learn from you. Mm -hmm. And uh, they're really nervous, so please smile, because looking at your faces, if you don't smile, it's, it's uh, not nice from being up here. So I want to thank Darren for coming along and everybody else from coming and have a just sit back, relax, enjoy. They're going to tell you about their product and what they do, and uh, I'll be taking photographs. So keep smiling, keep an eye for me. So Darren, I'll hand it over to Darren yep. here, and uh, please enjoy this after it's a bit different. Okay, everyone, uh, thanks for the introductions, and this is a big, big privilege for us to come along because this will be our first business presentation. Okay, and you guys are going to get the benefit of that, and hopefully. You can learn from us now. These guys that you see here, do you think they're well dressed? Yes. Oh, yes. Okay. Yes. Now we've done that for a reason because they're here for two reasons. First of all, yes, they're students like you. They're in school and they're studying. But secondly, and something that we count is very important, they are now businessmen because they are actively running their own business and making money from it. How does that sound? Yeah. Hands up who would like to run their own business and make money from it. Sounds good? Yes. Yeah. As much money as you want, you can buy whatever you want. For instance, I'll give you an example. Some of these guys have worked hard, made money, and instead of us maybe just giving them cash, what we've done is, because they might spend it on sweets and different things, and they just waste their money. What we've done is we take them to a sports store, and we bought this guy, Richard, a uh, brand new Northern Ireland kit. Okay? Short socks top, all for him, that's what he deserved. Other boys get football boots, other boys get trainers, and that's what we do with the money. And of course, we have to put some of the money back into the business to keep the business going over and over, okay? So, these boys have prepared a very interactive presentation, and they've also brought their product along with them for you to see what you think, okay? Uh, so I'm gonna pass it over to Thomas Bate, who is going to start us off. Maybe we'll give them all because they are slightly nervous. Good morning, friends. Um, my name is Thomas Bate. Uh, this is James Doyle. That's Richard Bishop. And that's Robert David. And that, in the back there is Thomas Clark. Um, we all started off in a room in Halloween. And we'd sent her at Tally Carney, all thinking about how to start a new business and what to do with it. We come up with dough, but that really had a name for it, to be quite honest. So someone said rainbowed it. We went ahead with that and started making it and getting all the stuff now for it. The first one was an email on it, and then we went on the trade first and stuff like that. Um, We've done it every Wednesday, all day. And then we were back in school and all. So it's quite good. Mm -hmm. That is. Rainbow Do has competitors like, for instance, has Play Do and Mundo. And see Play Do and Mundo, they're two big companies and they're very success successful. And we 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 went to um Rodney Miller Design Company for a day designing like new brands and things they had there. In the okay. We designed four new brands. This is one of them, this is the first one. It's the second one. And that's the third one. And that's the fourth one. It would be interesting to see, because the guys here 
they decided on which these four brand names, it's all for the same thing, it's all for the rainbow dough. But they had a, a, a brainstorming session with this, this company and these are the four different designs that they came up with. Now we elected a design that we thought was the best. This, when I say we, I mean the guys here. They decided what they thought was best. It would just be interesting to see these are the four designs, what do you think? That's the first design. There's the second design. There's the third design. And the fourth design. So what, what ones, what, what would you use have went for? The first one. Like you like the first one? Yeah. Let's see, hands up who likes the first one best. Okay. Yeah, there's quite a few for the first. What about the second one? Few for the second. Okay. What about the third one? Oh, not so many for the third one. Interesting. And what about the fourth one? Okay. Hey, John, you put your hand up for everyone. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. He likes them all then. Well, if we just go back, right? Oh, sorry, Robert can go ahead and explain then what one we went for. So, um, we got a new leaflet, so we did, and it's. It says on it like it's made by kids for kids and it's good clean fun and we've changed our email and the rainbow dough and then we we took we chose number three to with it. Yeah, that's what we yeah, so well done. Everybody I can see your, your t-shirts as well. There's a little one there. There's some of the t-shirts that are being worn. You've got a, a lovely rainbow on too. Okay. And then our labels, our new labels is that would be for the big tub on the top of it and the side of the big tub and that would be for the top of the small tub and the two sides of the small tub. Thank you. 